All right. About to get underway. This is the CMCC Esports Business Management Tournament Connect Four, one v one. Students are playing for prizes here, so should be pretty exciting. We're about to get this first game underway. We have eight competitors and two games going at once, but we'll be streaming one at a time. So we're about to get this first game going in just a second. Right. Looks like we got started. We got our first two competitors. Leo in the yellow and Morgan in the red. Looks like Morgan's using a clump up strategy. But he's getting dangerously close to a connect four. Leo seems to be wanting so far to take control of the bottom row. Actually, both players are getting pretty close to, to connecting four. They better be careful, think ahead. Morgan's thinking right now. Thinking long and hard where he wants to place this red piece. And I just noticed Leo on his last turn actually blocked Morgan's attempt at connecting four. And now Morgan has done the same to Leo. We're getting a pretty tight race here. I personally would have a hard time paying attention to all the all the spots on the board. Seems like the two are so far are doing a good job blocking blocking out the others access to winning there it is yeah. Leo with a connect four and they are playing they are playing a best of three from the sounds of it so leo in the yellow took the first game Yep, the colors are the same, so Morgan is now Morgan's turn on red. Both players so far are kind of just playing for, for positioning. In different types of games, like a shooter, this would, this would be playing map position. And if Leo's not careful here, okay, he found it. He found it. Morgan was dangerously close to connecting four. And he is again. Leo keeping a close eye on the board. <laughs> wow, Morgan played this round very well. thinking long and hard wants to play this morgan seems to have stepped up stepped up his game he is down one game to zero so he's got to win this one to stay in it Ooh. 
There it is, Morgan. Morgan takes this one in the red. So we're starting our third round of a best of three. Continuing with game three of this best of three, both Leo and Morgan have won a round. Uh, Morgan's playing really aggressive for this upward and right diagonal. Wow, there's, Ken there's four already. That was a quick one for Leo. Leo takes this first round over. Morgan. Well played. Alright, so Leo will advance. And Morgan will be disqualified. Not disqualified. Eliminated. And there is another game going on on another computer. So we will be waiting on the results of that one. So bear with us just a minute. found out the results of the other game that was going on at the same time. It was Amy versus Vincent, and Vincent won and has moved on to the next round of this bracket. Again, we started with eight players. Two have been eliminated, two have advanced, and we are about to start the next game. This is looking like it's Riley and Mason in this best of three connect four. These two, unlike Unlike the previous two on stream, these guys are, are kind of flying through so far. The other two seem to be thinking about their strategy a lot more. Riley is the yellow, and Mason is the red. Riley close to a to a fourth one in a row there, but Mason was able to block it. Ooh! Now Mason's getting close to four. There's a block right there. Oh, Mason. Mason will take the first of this best of three. Actually, Riley was very close to connecting four of his own. Right into round two. Again, Mason's with the red. Riley is with the yellow. They seem to just be stacking on top of each other so far. There's a block by Riley. Up strategies of this game. Kind of like chess, you want to be thinking, thinking ahead. Moves ahead. Ooh. Neither one appears to be super close to connecting four at this point. 45 seconds into this round. Jungle Fury, Jay Parker says. In the chat. Looks like Riley might be playing for that left to right. That left to right four, four piece here. Now, does he want to place a piece below? We got some yellow fans, fans of the yellow team here in chat. That would be Riley. 
It does have a big clump of yellow up top, but no way to connect four yet. Riley could actually win here if Mason's not careful, and Riley... Yep, there it is. Riley takes this one. All right, Mason was yellow after all. All right, that was Mason advancing, my apologies. Mason was the yellow. All right, we got another game underway. This one is now Vincent versus Mason. We haven't seen Vincent on stream yet. Mason just won his his bout. All right, we got Vincent in the yellow. Mason is now red. Both won their previous rounds. Right now, both players kind of stacking columns of tokens right now, whatever you whatever you call the the pieces that you play with. Neither one appears to be very close to a uh, connecting four as of yet. I'm not sure the strategy, honestly, here so far. Both players. Like I said, stacking on top of one another, maybe just trying to play super defensive. Vincent really taking his time here on this turn. Trying to peer across the board. Now we've slowed down. The action has slowed down as each player is really thinking hard. Again, Vincent is the yellow, Mason is the red. And we are correct this time, I asked the players. Ooh, there is a block by Mason. Vincent was looking for that four piece. Now Mason's looking kind of close to connecting four. Ooh, Vincent may have made a mistake. Doesn't seem like Mason really caught on to it, though. Mason could have won that round right there. He could have won it. Now, if Mason's not careful, Vincent could win. Both both players kind of playing for connecting four here on this left side. And I assume Mason is now thinking very hard about his next move. Each of them blocking each other. Again, oh, there's the win for Mason anyway, so it didn't actually end up mattering in the end. Mason could have won it a little earlier, but wasn't quite paying attention. All right, that was game one. We are now into game two. Mason took that, that game one. Mason's still in the red, Vincent in the yellow. like in that in that last game we saw jay parker had some money on yellow they said they would have won money had they actually been betting but i think that's illegal in this state vincent might be playing a long game trying to connect the bottom left to mid right diagonally 
Mason thinking about his next move. Where will he place this piece? We have a almost untouched right side of the board so far. Will he play over there or will he keep playing on this left side? Looks like he may decide to throw down on the right side. He will. Vincent getting dangerously close to it. That was a little telegraph. Vincent, unfortunately for him. You can see Mason, I assume, is avoiding this third from the left column because Vincent's looking for a connect four kind of beginning in that column. Again, we're just kind of stacking high. Stack and high, nobody's nobody appears to be super close to connecting four so far in this round. And Mason up one to nothing in this best of three. Mason is the red, Vince is the yellow. What will these players do? Both seemingly still avoiding this column until Mason just placed the token there. This game pushing three minutes this round. There it is for Vince. I honestly didn't even see that. I didn't see him playing for that one. Right into round three. Both players, Vince and Mason, with a round apiece in this best of three. Stack in the middle of the map, splitting it in half. Mason may be playing a long game here. He has three starting from the bottom right that he could connect if Vince isn't careful. Mason thinking. 45 seconds into this round. Now both players. Again, that, that third from the left column could be what wins it for either player. Both have to think. Think ahead here, like a game of chess. It's like colorful chess. Sounds like it's getting rowdy over there, where they're playing the game. It's getting a little more intense in this best of three. What is going to happen here? So we're still seeing this third from the left column bear. And either player, if the, if the other isn't careful, could win. Oh! That was a quick, quick win for Mason there, playing that left, left side. Vince maybe went a little too quick with his picks there. Mason will advance again. And I believe we are waiting. Yes, Leo and Brady are currently finishing their game. And then... We will be playing another game after that. So hold tight for the results of this next game.
still currently awaiting the match between Leo and Brady. Mason has advanced to a grand final. And after we play a grand final to decide the winner, we may be deciding playing another game to decide the third place, second and third place. We should we should clarify this match that has just begun is between Mason and Professor Libby, who is teaching this esports event management class. This is not for anything other than bragging rights. And I assume we'll cancel it once the once the next competitor is ready to face Mason in the actual grand final. <laughs> From the sounds of it, there may have been a, an actual tie in the game between Leo and Brady. So we're still awaiting that that game to end. But we are on, on board with Mason, who is awaiting his grand final opponent, and Professor Libby, who teaches the esports event management class. I believe Mason is yellow this game and Professor Libby is red. Mason was playing for a Connect Four there. If Professor Libby plays this right, Mason can't win off this one if he blocks it. There is the block. But Ooh, Mason seems to have had him in a checkmate there. Alright, we will be right back in a minute with the results of Leo versus Brady. Hang tight.
grand final underway for this Connect Four tournament. Brady ended up beating Leo in that match we were waiting on. So it's Brady in the yellow, Mason in the red. <clears throat> we are underway. It is a best of three, like the previous matches were. Again, both players kind of playing for positioning here. If Mason's not careful, he could win. Okay, he found it. Found it. Brady was playing for a quick round win there. Under a minute and a half if he won that. Mason may be playing for... Yeah, that was kind of tel telegraphed there along the bottom. I feel like playing for a bottom, bottom just straight across wind. It's kind of risky. It's sort of easy to spot. Mason could win here. He is the red again. Pretty soon. Wow. So can Brady. Mason just screwed up. Brady will take round one. Sometimes it is hard to see. That's why you really have to scan that board. We are going right into round two. Again, Mason red, Brady yellow. Beginning phases here. Everyone tries to decide, and by everyone I mean the two players, try to decide how they're going to try and win. Again, it's all about playing that long game. Thinking moves ahead. Unless the other player really isn't paying attention. Like right there. Brady wasn't so astute. Mason could have taken that round, brought it to a, a round three. This is the grand final of the Connect Four tournament. Mason is in the red, and Brady is the yellow. Brady did take round one in this best of three, so Brady wins here. That is the victory. If Mason wins, he'll take us to the round three. Mason blocking. A far right connect four of Brady's. Mason could play. He's sneaky about it. He could play for a connect four starting from the bottom left there. The two reds in a row. Brady's not careful. Mason could play for that horizontal win. You can tell Brady. With this yellow, this yellow turn here. Really thinking about his next move. You're approaching the two and a half minute mark in this round two. really taking its time here. That map is split in half. Something like, as of right now, the closest to a Connect 4 is Mason bottom left. It's a red red on the bottom there. Mason could be playing this really well. He just blocked Brady's attempt that he was going for. Lost another one and got the connect four. That that is. We are now tied in this series, one round to one round apiece. Mason took that round in a very quick fashion. It's over quick some some of these games.
Brady may have just won this. Brady appears to have checkmated Mason here. With those three yellows in a row, Mason can only block one side, meaning meaning that Brady has basically won in this best of three. We just got to see. Okay, there it is. And Brady takes the victory. Under a minute. That was a quick third round there to win it. Brady will win it. That was the Connect Four tournament put on by the CMCC Esports Event Management class. That was actually an event put on by Bryce, and I have been Darren, casting for this Connect Four tournament. Again, Brady was victorious over Mason in that grand final. It did go to a best of three, so it was very close, but Brady came out as the victor. All right. Thanks for watching. We are going to wrap things up here. And we will catch you next time.